Here we go, guys and girls, welcome back. This is like my sixth of attempt at trying to do this tutorial, this quick tutorial. I'm trying to do it in under two to three minutes. Um, right, so what we're going to quickly do, guys and girls, right, is a quick look at how to create an, a template for Altspace VR, which is a template that you can build. So if you wanted to sort of create your world. So say you created your world, this world I've created here, and I wanna say create it into a template for Outspace or want to upload it um, to Outspace VR. So what you'll wanna do is go to your file. Once you've like created your template, go to your file at the top, Go straight down to, uh, so once you get this, a folder should open up or a file of different files. You'll want to click on save, not save as, create the name for your template. And then what you'll want to do, once you've saved it, right, uh, you're going to have to use the, hold the arrow button, which is upwards, the, the arrow button up. Uh, it's usually to the, um, the left side. Uh, just below the caps lock um, or like two down from the tab button and you're on the keyboard so you'll want to hold that down scroll all this until it's all highlighted so hold it and then use your left um, mouse button and click it so all of them are clicked on and all highlighted except for the direction like you don't need that so all you need to do is hold the, the arrow button up and then scroll all the way down with the button until you get to the bottom and then just press the mouse button the left button to the thing until it's all highlighted then what you're going to need to do is click on out space vr at the top um until you've got two options you've got kits or you've got your templates click on templates and then this should open up this little window here now what you'll want to need to do is create new templates. So you click that button, that should take you to the Outspace website, uh, templates website. So you'll need to create your template. And once you've created your template, close the window. So there should be like a little button, a little line across. So make sure you close that button on the Outspace website. What you'll need to do then is once you've created your like template name, go to refresh now what you'll need to do is um, you've got below your advanced asset management don't click on any of that you don't need all that crap there so go below uh, where it says select template now it should be all highlighted all these ones you should have your new template here that you've created your new template once you've refreshed if you can't see it make sure you refresh it first at the top here so and then basically you'll see some more so what i'm going to do is going to click on game world project because that's the template i've created uh for my world and then what you'll want to do is it says choose a unity file now where you've just saved your file you need to look for your saved file so you need to click this three arrow button so there's a an arrow at work, three dots there. Like almost it's like four stops, but all together in a line. So you click that little one. Don't click this because that would just knock it all off. So click this one here. This is the three dots. So you click that. Then what you'll want to do, mine's called Strange New Worlds, the folder. You'll, uh, that's the actual Unity. Uh, when you create your Unity at the start, you got to create a name for it, or like, a, or you can just um, create new project. Just keep it as a new project. But I do. Um, I create a name for it. Now you want you want to do is to click assets, and once you created uh, clicked on your assets, now you could go to scenes, but that's just basically your samples. So I've already basically created a separate name. But the separate names are not in the ones here. So once you've created it, you should actually see this little thing here with a unity symbol. 
and it should say about of all the information that you've saved kilobytes wise and all that uh, so what you'll want to do is click on that that's within the assets so once you clicked on that go to open um, I'll click on it and then what you should see now is mine's called woodlands dot unity um, and then what you'll want to do is make sure all these are ticked make sure they've got Mac is ticked Android's ticked and Windows ticked now if you've got your VR headset or Windows you could either do it in virtual reality or you can do it in 2D I do it in virtual reality because when you put the VR headset on the Oculus Quest which is to do with your Android uh, you need to make sure that's ticked for Android because that's your VR headset uh, and it'll work appropriately. Uh, Windows is basically your uh, virtual reality headsets for PC or you can do it in 2D. And your Mac is basically, um, well, I don't think it's got virtual reality headset support at the moment for the Mac. But you can go on to um, Outspace 2D on the Mac and you can still play on that and it works fantastic I've tried it a few times now what you'll want to do is go to once that's all done you'll want to go to build and upload and that is basically it guys and girls that is the sort of easy basic tutorial on how to upload as a template uh, upload world template and that's pretty much it for this uh, tutorial if you guys and girls enjoy this quick tutorial as quick as i possibly can uh do it in such a time um leave a like favorite share comment and subscribe to the channel guys and girls it does help and i will see you on the next episode it is friday 17th of december 2021 at the time of the video and it's 6 47 in the morning thanks for watching and i will see you on the next tutorial